Hey everybody, so one problem that we've been having lately is that we get a page for YouTube that looks like this. Now this is a supply and demand video from Crash Course. It is school appropriate, but it's saying that it's restricted here and I need to try signing in with a Google Apps account. Now this is happening to both our students and our staff. So please look and pay attention. So what is here is we have this up here and I know if it's telling me check to make sure I'm logged in, I go up here and it says, hey, test to dmars at ccs.coloma.org. Hey, that's me, I'm logged in, what's going on? I need help. Well, what's happening is that we've created a content channel called test two at some point that's causing this to be broken for me. Now it might be something like I, can't, I saw when Aaron plays games today. Okay, that's one, um, you know, it could be like, you know, best gamer ever or something like that for our content channel that our kids get excited about YouTube and we should celebrate some of that. Like there's a lot of creation and possibility happening there. But on the flip side, what we have is we have to make sure that our kids can watch the educational videos that we are sending them and asking them to watch without coming to the screen. So how to fix that is there's really a quick way. First, you can switch account right here. That will allow me to pick the account that I wanna switch into if I need to switch back to the one that has my name. It should say Daniel Mars. And that will make sure that I can watch the YouTube videos and approve YouTube videos for our students. Now on the flip side, if I wanna make sure that this doesn't happen again and I wanna delete this so that I don't stumble or don't have to do this step again, it's really easy for me to go to settings. And on setting, it's gonna take me to a new page and once I'm there, I want to find advanced settings on the left-hand side. And when I click on advanced settings, it'll give me the option at the very bottom of this page to delete the channel. And once I delete that channel, it's gonna make sure that I am the one that should be deleting it. And then I'm going to have to make a decision about hiding or deleting. I'm gonna to choose to delete. I'm gonna check that box. That means that I'm losing everything that I've created. And I just have to type in the name of the channel there and hit delete my content. Now I'm gonna be signed out of YouTube, but when I go back into YouTube, what you should notice is you should notice that I have my account back and I can sign in with my school account and be set to go with all of my pages. So I hope that helps. Have a wonderful day. Thanks for